Hi guys, this is Ratchet Throw, and today we're gonna continue playing Criminal Case, and we are going on Case 24. All right, thank you, friends. Let's go. Do -do 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 -do. Boop. We're here. Hanging by a thread. The puppeter, what you done? I think I'm glad to see you. This message on the puppeter really worries me. Hello, little puppet. I hope you like my show. After all, what will a carnival be without a good puppet show? This is an open treat that the puppeter will start killing again. And the carnival is today. Today, I want you to patrol the parade with Frank and patrol the parade. I was looking forward to staying in an inn and spending some quality time with my turn. Frank, just do as I say for once, will you? I'm just late for work again, and I'm tired of you answering back to my, me like an irreverent teenager. I'm still chief of police here. Sorry, I don't mean you, of course, but you really must be alert, so the carnival takes place without incident. With the puppeteer's message in mind, we can not leave anything to chance. I also need people to do a security check in the storage rooms. Katarina, you'll make sure everything's alright. I'm counting on you. Okay, later in the carnival storage room. I don't know what's wrong with Andrea today, she's like a nagging mom. I never seen her like that before, she's really on edge, worried. Uh, the victim is just behind you, Frank. Oh well, at least here in the storage room we can have a little more fun. Okay, what do you say we try our cars to turn off the lights to scare each other? No, 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 we won't do that, we, are, we have to patrol something. Alright, okay, okay, I get it, we're here to look around. Alright, let's start with that pretty looking marionette in the corner. It's not a marionette. Victim. Okay, it's becoming more and more exciting. Ah, oh, there you are, it's that woman again. I forgot what's her name. Oh, where's Bossy Cop? It's here, traveling. Broken pieces and handbag. Oh, Dinah, her name is Dinah. What the? The week has been all cut up and linked back together with Chase. She's look like she looks like a like a movie puppet. You're right. This visit must be the work of the puppet, or I can't believe it. It's after ten years, the murders have started again. Oh wait a second, you're telling me the victim is Dinah Cooper, the jazz dancer? She was one of the first suspects you met in Chester, wasn't she? Yes, she was. Poor girl, I know you won't let the puppeter get away with this, Katarina. I agree, Katarina, we should start by sending the body to Roxy. I need to find Dinah's back. Let's have a look inside and see what clues we can find. And whatever these pieces are, I trust you'll put them back together while I go get some fresh air. I'm feeling queasy. What's wrong, Frank? Start the autopsy, and I'm uh, gonna need some stars to do all of this. Let's so see you all bet. Okay, I got the three stars. First, let's do this from the figurine. That's a figurine has Dinah Cooper's name on it, that there is something written on the base. It reads, Freddy, I'm an artist and a toy, and unfortunately choice of words from Dinah given she ended up like a puppet. Oh, you're right, we do know a Freddy, isn't he, isn't he the guy who organized the carnival? Yep, is he, it's him. And that's true, Freddy's parents were also killed by the puppet, though. what a coincidence. And what's this artist versus toy team? Was Freddy controlling her in some way? I don't know, let's go see Freddy and find out. Okay. First, let's do this handbag. Okay. Invitation for Dinah Cooper. Find it useful in the victim's back and they have some kind of invitation. But it's always fun, but that invitation is half furious. Do you think you could figure out what it is for, Katarina? It's okay, why do you ask me all that? Let's do this for your invitation. Welcome aboard 
D uppercase. Retreated details on this invitation. It's for a boost cruise or, or steamboat party or whatever you want to call it. Oh, you're right. Today. This invitation was clearly addressed to our meter. It could be why don't you saw you from murder. It was a good word of Abigail. But well, let's go check it out. I just hope you don't get seasick. Don't worry, I won't. Okay, let's go investigate the deck. Pigeon, it's here. Got a whiskey bottle. It's here. A little shoe and fried egg. I'm glad you picked up on those clues, Katarina. Maybe I should just let you do the work while I sit back in the tray boat right? No, you gotta work with me. Why did you pick up that champagne bucket? The bottle's missing. We can't even have a drink. Oh, you still wanna look at it, Katarina. Nice, you also found a phone. People always leave private information on their gadgets. I'm gonna look decoding it. Good luck. What did I just say? <laughs> but, 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 I need a few. I'm gonna need a few more stars. A little bit. Okay, I collect three stars. So, first let's do this locked cell phone. Steamboat way faster than I expected. That guy looks familiar, doesn't he? Alright, I remember. He said he said not we met during the Civil War in Ackman. I don't know how this phone fits into the current investigation, but you're right. We did find it on a crisis, so let's send it to the lab. Okay. Okay, now let's do this champagne bucket. Much younger, though, wouldn't you agree? I look at the person she's standing next to. His face is all scratched out. And what the? You act there. Look at the man's hands. He's clearly a puppeter. That was turning to a puppet. If, if she wants you a puppeter, we need to find out his identity. Do you think you can run his profile through the database, Katarina? It's a can. Why are you asking me all that? Okay, let's do this unidentified person. even scary with all this face paint on. Do you think a daughter could hate her dad and not to scratch out his face? I wonder if my daughters would do the same. Uh, sorry, but damn, okay, that's true. Not only did Dinah hate her father, but he he's also the uh, puppet dwarf. Let's go talk to him. Oh my. But, 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 I'm gonna need a few more stars to talk to those two. You know what, I'm gonna wait for it is body and cell phone to finish, so see you all bet. Alright, we are back with the real case. Don't worry guys, I'm alive. I didn't go away from this spot here. Alright, case 24, hanging by a thread. Alright, uh, Roxy tells everything you know about the victim. Well, okay, they are victim must have really been hung up about something before she died. Oh wait, she was hung up. Roxy had to find your pants and the and the ring. But Katarina is right, we are dealing with a serial killer here, so cool it down the jokes. But for starters, he really was injected with sedatives before being killed. Katarina is surely come in handy during your investigation. 
Then her body was cut out with a saw, so keep an eye open for that kind of instrument. The body was strung up in an extremely complex manner. The puppeter had to know the precise me instruments of the chains and the weight distribution of the mechanics. As gruesome as this sounds, it's a work of art. I can tell you that the puppeter is definitely good with mechanics. Oh, okay. Oh, the serial killer. This is becoming more and more exciting when there's a serial killer on the loose. Okay, let's get started on that cell phone. So today I had a look inside Stanley Bullock's phone and guess what? He knew you were victim. He kept sending Dinah messages to tell her we would bring eggs or that she could borrow moves from him. After a little dingy, it turns out Stanley and Dinah were neighbors and are quite friendly ones it seems. Uh, isn't it weird that a confederate lover would be friends with Dinah? And what's up with all that face paint? I agree. First the server war out with now this Stanley sure likes to rescue. Isn't he too old for that? Oh fuck you. Oh, you're right to remind me, country. As you know, Stanley was also a previous suspect in the Puppeter case all those years ago. A former Puppeter suspect living so close to the victim, he could have easily gained Dinah's confidence. Come on, country. What do you say we go pay him a neighborly visit? Okay. Okay, some of our suspects has that uh, makeup, so. So it must be a part. piece of the evidence we need. So. Okay. Let's go talk to Freddy. Well, it's a good idea. Our paths keep crossing off the for unpleasant reasons. What can I do for you this time? Dinah Cooper was just murder. You could explain why she would accuse you of treating her like a toy for a start. Dana was killed? That's terrible. We were walking together for the carnival. I heard her to dance on the main float. When it turned out, the woman had two left feet. I tried to teach her, but she kept getting it wrong. She got annoyed and claimed I was too controlling, but I was just doing my job. So Dana claimed you were too controlling, only to end up strong up like a puppet. See where we're going with this. Dad was murdered by a puppeter. If the killer has started killing again after all these years, I can still remember the day the puppeter murdered my parents like it was yesterday. The poor girl, she didn't deserve to die like this. Oh my god. Okay, let's go talk to Blake. You are here to ask about troublesome daughter of mine. Whatever trouble she's in, I don't care. We haven't spoken in years. Oh, it didn't, so... Well, whether you care or not, your daughter's just been murdered. I'm not surprised. Anna's always been a magnet for trouble. She ran away from home to a life on the stage and got herself pregnant. It was, she wouldn't let me see my own grandson. She thought I was a bad father, too, so I didn't deserve to see Louis. Like she was a model mom, single and dancing in a bar. Please, Dr. Davis, right? How could you be so heartless? Your only daughter is just being murdered, and still you claim it's her own fault. I gave up on my daughter long ago. She was uncon uncontrollable. If only she could have been more like my puppets, just one pull of the strings and they'd obey. Okay, I don't like this guy. I agree, Katria. As Dinah's father and the puppeter, Mr. Cooper is already a prime suspect. He didn't even seem to care about his daughter's murder. You're right, serial killers are known to be heartless. I'm not saying he's a puppeter, but we should keep an eye on him. Okay, I agree. Okay, now let's go start to Stanley. And he's got makeup. Mr. Bullock, is there going yes here to ask you a few questions about your neighbor, Dinah Cooper? Ah, Dinah, things have been hard for her, raising her son Louis on her own, so I try to do what I can to help out, like a good neighbor. Thing is, she's been murdered by the puppeter, which brings us to you and your previous incident. Dinah was murdered by the puppeter? That's awful. Wait a minute, you're here because I used to be a puppeter suspect, aren't you? I was found innocent. And besides, I never heard Dinah. I care too much about her. Why are you sweating? You think I'm going to arrest you? Katria yeah, has to throw up the work all day and he's not picking up the phone. Have you heard from him? No, I didn't. What? Jan's missing out on the puppeter's first murder in 10 years? He's been obsessed with this serial killer and now, of all times, he's just vanished. Okay, I need a recap here, Katarina. The puppeter strikes again after 10 years, killing Dinah. Dinah's father, who's a real puppeter, claims not to have spoken to her in years. He sounds a bit controlling, and Dinah was a rebel child, so it's no surprise. And then we have Dinah's neighbor, Stanley, who had already been tried in, been tried in a puppeter case, but if his phone can be trusted, they were actually pretty friendly. Holy is it, yeah, so relieved to see you. I don't know if you remember me. I'm mean, Jan's wife. Hi! Okay, of course he remember you. Is something wrong, Jessica? They said, okay, yeah, we need your help. The puppeter broke into our house. Ooh. 
Alright guys, we're gonna stop here, we're gonna continue playing in chapter 2. Thank you for watching, don't forget to leave a like to this video, and I'll see you again. Goodbye.